friends. <laughs> um, so I am getting ready to do my makeup in a rush as usual. Uh, today it was not my fault. I was up at seven, but then um, my husband turned over on his side and laid on my shoulder and then I was stuck. He told me later that I could have just woken him up to get ready, but that's not me. I let him sleep. He was sleeping so soundly, so I did not want to bother him. So anyways, I got up. It was like a little after 8.30 when I finally got up and got in the shower. So today I am probably only going to do my foundation here with you just because the last few times I have been doing my eyeliner with you but oh my gosh every time I put my foundation on I am just amazed at how well it covers up all of my blemishes good morning Nicole it's so good to see you um so as you can see I've got all these blemishes. Oh, thank you, Nicole. I hadn't even said that yet, but yes, as always, when you share my videos, you get another entry into our giveaway. So, um, our drawing. So thank you so much for sharing, Nicole. All right. So I have my primer on and as usual, I am going to be using my B fit and I'm going to mix it with my CC today. As I mentioned the last time, the CC is the darkest that we had um, in this foundation. It's actually a color control skin perfecting balm. So I'm gonna put some on my hand. <laughs> Thank you. And then I'm going to put um, some of our B Fit tinted moisturizer and I'm going to do it in a one-to-one -one ratio so I'm going to put basically that just means that I'm putting about the same amount of each of these on my arm on my hand then I just mix them together and seriously the last few times that I've been doing my making my makeup I thought why have I not been showing how amazing the coverage is for this foundation combination that I do um, I you know recently I told you guys that I tried a new foundation stay matte I still cannot find the right shade but this B fit tinted moisturizer it seems to do the trick and I to be honest I'm tired of trying thank you Nicole um, these were, I, I want to say they were from one of our Mother's Day sets. Um, they're a retired earring, but they're like back when we had some, I think it was like Mother's Day collections. And I think this was one of them. But yeah, they're one of my favorites too. And for Sunday, I especially love them because they've got the pearl. And it makes me feel like they're um, a little bit more dressed up for church. So... Oh, but anyways, you guys, I am tired of trying to find the correct color combination of foundation. So I think I am just going to stay with what I have. The colors, the foundations that I love are the CC because it has such wonderful coverage. You can see how it's perfected the color on my skin look at look at how you see my forehead still but the rest of my skin um i feel like it blends in really well with my skin tone when i add that b-fit and my skin like seriously looks better than it's looked in years um i lived in hawaii for three and a half years and it wasn't until I moved away um, and we went from the tropical, you know, kind of humid, but really beautiful um, climate of Hawaii. We moved from there to Utah um, back in 2000. How old was my son? He was born in 13, 16, 2016, 17. I can't even remember the dates, 
but my son was about to turn three and we moved to Utah and I didn't realize it until later how dry and how awful this the climate in Utah was for my skin and I would see my memories pop up look at that you guys no redness in my skin it's amazing um and so when I was in Utah I you know I started getting these really awful breakouts and it wasn't even anyways it was breakouts like not even just during you know that time of the month it was just like oh my gosh like why does my skin never clear up and I tried so many different things um, and it really didn't help much um, I have been now finally I've been able to use some skincare products that have been actually really helping the last um, couple of weeks as I've been continuing to cleanse my skin every day using a face scrub um, a few times a week with my pharmacy products. I wash my face and when I rinse off all of the product, um, the cleansers, I literally like my skin feels squeaky clean and I feel so many less bumps on my cheeks. So I am excited to continue using the products because of course you can't just use them and then stop because you need to continue on. The consistency is what helps and even all of the things that I had tried before being consistent seriously for like years I tried and nothing worked. So, and of course, my skin still isn't perfect because as you go throughout the process, you know, it takes some time for everything to smooth over. But in the meantime, um, as I continue to fix the blemishes on my face, um, I've, I'm also trying to cut down on the sweets, which is really hard. But this foundation, you guys, just blows me away and I am always amazed at the difference in my skin so there you have um, my little cocktail of foundations that I love my CC cream in medium to dark this is the darkest color we have um, number four and then our BeFit tinted moisturizer this is also the darkest one we have it's um 03 dark but i love this combination and yeah let's see what time it is i've got a few more minutes to do my makeup and i put a little bit too much foundation so that kind of makes me sad <laughs> i should maybe get a container and put that in there but hmm, i didn't think of that before anyway so Let's continue to see how much I can get done before church. <laughs> and then keep going. I'm going to use, because I'm short on time, I'm going to use the tiny bit of <laughs> eyebrow pencil I have left. Um, just because my eyebrow pom pomade just takes a little bit longer since I try to... Be a little bit more meticulous on how I apply it this is kind of just a color in and go right so that is what I'm doing here with this and I'm gonna go on the other side and fill in my brows this eyebrow is actually a little bit less um, filled in because I have a Scar that I try to that I try to cover up, and I always have to make sure that I it's the scars right here. Maybe I'll show you guys one day, but today I have this right here, and and I just realized that there's a few stray hairs that I probably should. Luck. <laughs> I haven't done that in a while, but it's okay. 
All right, I think that's gonna be enough for today on my eyebrows. Um, all right, now from here, I think I'm just gonna wipe this off because I don't have, no, I'll leave it on there just in case I need it later. <laughs> all right, let's see here. Let's do some eyeliner. Oh, and since I'm just wearing black, I'm just gonna go with black eyeliner today. You guys, my husband just came down and told me that I've got to get going. So, I am going to have to just remain a little bit more plain for church. I think I'll probably apply my <laughs> eyelash, um, my mascara in the car because that'll make it so much easier. Um, and we're wearing our masks during all of church anyway, so it doesn't really matter. All right, you guys, I'm going to get going because I got to go, but at least I've got a little bit of my eyes done. I will put some mascara on in the car. Um, I hope you all have a blessed Sunday and a relaxing day. And thank you so much for joining me again. Um, if you share my video, you will get another entry or an entry if you haven't already got entries into our end of the month drawing. Thank you, Nicole. You have a good day too. Um, and my name is Lilina Marlowe. I'm a beauty influencer with Pharmacy and I have enjoyed being here with you and showing you the amazing transformation with my foundation. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will talk to you again soon. Bye.